Okay, so a really simple drill to improve your rotational and your hand movement coming in towards the impact area <laughs> is to place the club, literally place the club through your belly button, right? And then take hold of the rest of the club. So your arms are pretty comfortable, but so you keep this in contact there. Now, the idea is if I sort of face you guys, there's two things that we're trying to manage coming in towards this through swing position. One is maintaining hip depth. So if I draw a line on the back of my hips here, that basically means not moving closer towards the ball to target line and getting the left hip back. The second one is chest rotation. And obviously sort of concentrate when I say chest rotation, lower body up through the chest region. All of this needs to be rotating towards the target. As long as we can rotate towards the target whilst maintaining hip depth, what will simultaneously happen is that left shoulder will retract out the way, which means that you'll get the feeling that your arms can keep traveling towards the target. However, what tends to happen is when we talk about, I would say sort of forearm rotation in the golf swing, is that definitely you need forearm rotation coming into a late down swing to be able to square the face. But then as we go in towards a through swing, it's acceptable to have some forearm rotation. And for golfers that produce a decent amount of club head speed, it's, it's almost an inevitability. But obviously there's a big difference between having some forearm rotation in the through swing compared to like a stalling out lack of lower body movement or chest rotation. Um, and getting too handsy. So this drill will just give you a good feeling. So the idea is you place it in the stomach region and you literally just sort of swing through to when the club's about parallel placed. What you're looking for is the club face to be, uh, to be parallel towards your spine line. But it should also be well angled like so, right? So if I drew a rough plane guide in here, it would also be roughly perpendicular to the plane line. Now again, if I stood up a little bit, club face will start to look more vertical. If I do this exercise again, but this time I don't, carry on rotating with my body and I sort of stop here, then my hands will continue to take that club through. And that's again when that club face starts to close down a little bit too much. So this is a good drill. Uh, definitely something that you can kind of work in down the driving range, sort of plonk that in there, work on a nice little sensation and feeling of the pivot. And then just sort of try and incorporate that into some, some short swings, yeah, like so. Try and turn that body through do the drill, mess around with trying to recreate that same, I'd say, orientation so the correct same angles. And like I say, it's all about experimentation, probably video it to make sure you're doing those correct sort of things. And then you can look to take it forward from there. Let me know how you get on. I'll see you guys again really soon.